Unfortunately, the total solar eclipse is over and the next chance at viewing this celestial event in our area won't be until 2099. You might have to travel to get to the next one. So our Maya May joins us here in the studio this morning. So Maya, a lot of us took advantage of seeing this. Uh, some were calling a once in a lifetime event. How were people here reacting? Yes, people looking at the total solar eclipse were in awe and people were in awe. Just yesterday, our WTOL 11 team spread throughout the entire region. Most of the people we spoke to say it was the moment that they didn't want to miss. Visitors traveled from all over the world and locals welcomed the crowds. The total solar eclipse was called the Super Bowl of Science and it brought thousands of people together. Unfortunately, it will take 75 years to see another total eclipse in Ohio, which is one of the reasons people came far and wide to witness the event. We spoke with people all over the region from Bowling Green to downtown Toledo to others in their own backyards and surrounding areas and from out of state like Madison, Wisconsin. And here are what they had to say. I was reading that the next one that's going to be fully overhead Madison is going to be in September of 2099. So I uh, hope to live forever. I think this is a better bet. The sun is into uh, space and all that stuff. So it was only right that we drove out here. Seeing like the uh, Bailey's beads, seeing all of it was just incredible. I it was worth the five hour drive here. <laughs> it was a crazy, it was amazing, it was exciting. I would wait another 20 years to see this. WTOL 11 has covered the total solar eclipse for a full year. You can find the moments leading up to the event as well as during and after at fox36.com. Just click the WTOL 11 link. For now, I'm Maya May reporting in studio for WTOL 11 on Fox 36.